So the whole experience around the movies are changing. It's more immersive. It's more interactive. But what does it take to bring people to the theater to really experience it? Joining me is Richard Hart, of course, who's into everything when it comes to media, entertainment, technology. Richard, what's going on with the whole new movie experience? Well, as you just said, the exhibitors need something special to give the audiences that mm -hmm. they can't get anywhere else. And right. that thing today is 3D. 3D, 3D is Glasses. going to bring them in. Demonstra uh, audiences de have demonstrated they're willing to pay a dollar to two dollars more per ticket to see the same movie in 3D as wow. opposed to 2D. And that's clearly been demonstrated by the last six 3D movies. Well, I've seen IMAX movies that are in 3D. Are you talking about the same type of 3D? No, nope, no, nope, nope. this is new. Beowulf will be the big test. Coming up in about two weeks, a movie named Beowulf, it's a sort of an animation with motion capture, will be released by Bob Zemeckis. Mm. And it'll be released simultaneously on screens in two different 3D technologies. So... Uh, the, the joke is that it's going to make three times as much money because people are going to go see it in uh, one, uh, one of the formats, which is Real-D, right. another one which is Dolby's 3-D, and a third one which is 2-D, just to compare them so it'll make three times the money. But is it a good movie? Remember the whole movie Bubble exactly. that Silver came out with, yeah. which was horrible? Yeah. Okay. If you don't have a good script and you don't have a good movie, you could give 3-D a bad name. Okay. And? But Zemeckis is good. There and, you go. and look at the, the success of Polar Express, his first 3-D effort. So... But watch Beowulf. If Beowulf does well, in the next 12 months, you'll see 15 to 20 3D features released in 2008. And real quick, the companies to look at that are doing this 3D camera work, uh, companies that are working in 3D film, what are the ones we should be paying attention to? Well, there, there are companies who are working on the capture technology. There aren't enough cameras to go around, by the uh, way. Okay. 3D cameras, are you can, you can get a premium price for them if you have one. The distribution and the projection is in Dolby okay. and, and in Real-D. Real D shows the left eye something polarized, whoops, left eye, uh, polarized different from the right eye. Okay. And Dolby shows the left eye colors that the right eye can't see, and the right eye sees colors that the left eye can't see. So one does it with color, the other does it with polarization. So Dolby is one of them, what's another company? There are only two technologies in the theaters, that's it. It's wow. Dolby versus Real D. That, that's those it. Those are your only choices. Richard Hart, thanks a lot for hanging out with us. I can't wait to see 3D in real 3D. Technology, 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 technology.